In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to view GitHub commit history. Navigating through the vast universe of GitHub to check the commit history of a repository can initially seem like a daunting task, especially if you're new to the platform. But don't you worry, by the end of this guide, you'll understand exactly how to do it step by step in a seamless manner. Let's start at the very beginning. The first thing you'll need to do is visit GitHub's website. GitHub is the leading platform for version control and collaboration allowing millions of developers to share and work on code together. On the GitHub homepage, you'll notice a button labeled Sign In. This is your gateway to accessing your repositories and viewing their commit histories. Clicking on Sign In will take you to a new page where GitHub asks for your username or email address. This is how GitHub verifies your identity and ensures that you, and only you, can access your repositories. Make sure to enter the details correctly to avoid any access issues. Once you've entered your username or email address, the next prompt will ask for your password. Passwords are case sensitive, so be attentive while entering yours to avoid any unnecessary hiccup in logging in. After inputting your credentials, you will click the sign in button, which essentially tells GitHub, hey, it's me, let me in. And in just a moment, you will find yourself on the GitHub dashboard. This dashboard is your control room on GitHub. From here, you can navigate to all your repositories, see your contributions and much more. Now, say you want to take a look at the commit history of a particular repository. The first step is to select a repository from your dashboard. Each repository on GitHub is a storage space where a project resides. It can contain all sorts of files like code, documentation, config files and more. For our purpose, think of a repository as a book, and each commit made to that repository as a page in that book. After selecting a repository, you're going to look for a tab or a label named commits. Clicking on this will open up the history of all the changes made to the repository over time. Each commit entry includes the commit message, which is a brief description of what was changed, the name of the contributor who made the commit, and timestamps showing when each commit was made. This is incredibly useful for understanding the development process of a project, tracking progress, or even rolling back to previous versions if a newly introduced change breaks something. Viewing the commit history is like having a time machine that lets you travel back and forth across a project's timeline. Each commit is a snapshot of the project at a specific point in time, allowing developers to keep a comprehensive record of what changes have been made and why. Here's a pro tip. While browsing through the commit history, look out for commit messages. Good commit messages are short yet descriptive, giving you a clear understanding of what changed without needing to dive into the code itself. This can save you a lot of time, especially when you're trying to pinpoint when a specific feature was added or a bug was fixed. Remember, the beauty of GitHub is not just in sharing code or collaborating on projects. It's also in the ability to trace back the footsteps of a project's development journey through its commit history. This history is invaluable both for new team members getting up to speed and for long-term documentation of a project's evolution. And that, folks, is how you view a project's commit history on GitHub. It's a straightforward process once you know where to look. Whether you're a seasoned developer or just starting out, being able to navigate through a repository's timeline is a critical skill in understanding and contributing to projects effectively. Thank you for joining me today. Remember, practice makes perfect. So go ahead, explore some commit histories and see what stories they tell you about the projects you love or are working on. Until next time, happy coding.